Over the next two weeks, we'll take you hunting for two of the three tur species. Tur hunts are said to be the toughest hunts in the world because of the steep and untamed Caucasus Mountains. First, we'll hunt the Mid-Caucasian Tour, and eventually we'll travel 200 kilometers west to hunt the Kuban. With an enormous amount of preparation and hard work, we hope to transpire luck. Coca-Cola. Mmm, uh, fix anything. Things went from uh, bad to worse here. I lost my tent. Welcome to Russia. My name is Travis Volk. Let's go hunting. Headed up out of the hunting house this morning. We're, uh, we got about an hour and a half to the place where we actually drop the trucks and about a two hour climb to tree line where we're gonna camp. It's a beautiful country. Looks like it's gonna be a great trip. and the mountains are looking pretty darn steep but uh, the weather is just as good as it could be for us and everything's lined up so it's pretty special we're making good time we've done about a thousand feet climb so far and, uh, about an hour such a perfect time in here cattle country. Reminds me of Montana and uh, it's great to be in the steep mountains and we finally are in a, a natural place that really feels like hunting. We've been blasting really hard, but uh, we've only picked up a few females down below so far. It's so steep, it's crazy. We went to bed full of anticipation watching Tur feed out at last light. Just got light and uh, we see a few turn coming up over the top. One small belly, but uh, mainly females.
fortunate when we came across this big long slide to see quite a few deer riding down on this bowl. They've got us kind of locked up in the moment, but there's a big group up in this section here. There's one down below us, and they saw, we saw two, two really nice big deer going up over the top over there. Probably try to hunt them tonight. Animals started moving just before dark, and the next thing we knew, we were in a last minute foot race with no cover.
You ready, Craig? Yes. Yes. It look it look it. it looks back. Come on, get down. It's hurting good. Yeah, I'm gonna that ball. Mom seal. Twenty? You gotta be kidding me! Unbelievable! We have never done this before. It's the biggest, the oldest one you've ever killed. Yeah. Really? Yes, I'm the oldest. We never shoot by ourselves. Yes, I could kiss you. No. I could kiss you. Telling me <laughs> stuff like that. Oh my gosh! The oldest, oldest Billy they've ever taken. That's exciting. Do you want to? Oh, yeah. oh man. You know, the way you described how big he was really cracks me up. Because <laughs> most Monster. people would tell you that he's got really beautiful horns. And, you know, these guys quantify the size of the trophy by the bellow in the belly. <laughs> the round of the belly. I love that. Paid off coming back here. A little extra work always gets the job done. Maybe back home is the line. Yeah. <laughs> Last chance to back home. Oh, there's no turn around now. like a uh, Navy SEAL instructor. You want to quit? Yeah, exactly. All you got to do is ring the bell. <laughs> We're not ringing the bell. <laughs> I didn't hear no damn bell. Thanks a lot for all your hard work, guys. Thanks for being here, Craig. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Wow. And the best news is, we're not going to have to do that hike twice. <laughs> Holy smokes. It is going to be heavy packed. After 14,000 feet of vertical rise and fall in a 24-hour day, 5,000 of the steepest going up and down in the dark, the difficulty of this hunt will have to be left to your imagination. But taking a 20-year-old ram, possibly the oldest ever recorded, made for a truly unforgettable accomplishment.